today is the 1st of March. I had a bunch of videos recorded, but I thought, let me just do this special today because it's a new month keep it fresh. Today the video is how I got into filmmaking so it could be a long one today. I'm a movie lover at heart you know. It's like movies that I could tell you all the dialogue from start to end of my favorite movies minute for minute almost and I'd watch movies like at least three times over. That's like one of my things that I like to do like even if I wasn't into filmmaking I'd be an avid movie watcher enthusiast. I wouldn't say I'm a film buff but I just like movies in year eight these people came into school and they was like oh do you want to do this Duke of Edinburgh scheme I was thinking about it and I was like oh yeah but I was too late on the list I found a center outside where you could do the Duke of Edinburgh scheme they said yeah I got to do a physical recreation a skill a service and expedition I saw like the skill list and I was like oh video editing and one of my friends like he already did like music videos and stuff so i knew like video editing was a big part of making films and filmmaking and stuff like that yeah i would like to do that that would be a good thing to learn that's my kind of interest so i was like yeah i'll just do that i, I started going there which was the training resource center in wandsworth a guy was supposed to be teaching me editing on like old final cut pro well it's old now but it wasn't old then i don't think but he was never around. First day he was like, okay, there's the cut button. It's how you, you know, save a project or whatever. Then he was gone. And uh, every week I'd come back and he wouldn't be there. So I was like, oh, okay. So I just kind of learned on my own. And in that place, the TRC, they had a studio in the back, which they had like all these like young artists, just like the school people. And they made like their tracks. And then I'd shoot the music videos for them. So I'd do all the music videos and stuff like that and I'd put it together and, you know, so I was just learning and putting all the mad effects on there and stuff like that. Just experimenting and, like, having fun. It's probably bad now, but then it was, I thought, oh, yeah, it's the best thing ever. But the thing about being at the TLC is they kept losing my work. Like, every time I'd come back, the a project wouldn't be there or the project files would be gone or, like, I was just doing it for practice and I was just like, hey, I want to have like something to show for it but nothing it was all just gone i was trying to get a camera and my own editing computer so i could edit at home so i was like dad please can you like get me a, a camera or whatever whatever and he was like oh maybe when your birthday comes around so i was like saving like all the the money i could get and then he'd top it off with my birthday funds but in the meantime i think i borrowed my auntie's little JVC camera but I think it kind of happened at the same time the computer and the, or the computer maybe a bit before it was just the bare minimum for video editing basically and then I had to get a little graphics card and put that in or a little video card so I could put Firewire to Mini DV in there and then I got my friend to give me a crack version of Adobe Premiere Pro so that was like my first encounter with like editing I was doing like a lot of videos practicing a lot like different different cuts different angles making commercials not real commercials but like my own little commercials and my own little music videos on my own short films just on my little camera so that took me up until last year of school probably so i was doing a lot of stuff and filming birthday parties or all these kind of little things that i was filming like just trying to see how it worked and see how cuts worked and see how this worked and that worked never anything really professional it wasn't like now where you had like lenses and stuff and all that kind of thing it was kind of just like just zoom in zoom out you know get a tripod stick it there so it was fun and i would go in my little short films because i couldn't find anyone to be in them so i was just like putting the camera here putting the camera there but it was all just like experimentation and just like trying things out you know this is actually fun when you see results as well you're like oh this is actually good that's a short introduction as I can make. Next video I'll probably do will probably be how I got into the film industry. Getting into filmmaking and then getting into the film industry is like two different things. That's all I'll say for now. Cool.